You know, I really love this time of year. The leaves start to change. There's pumpkins and bonfires. Yeah, the fall's nice, but I gotta tell you the truth. Yeah? I'm a little bit worried about Sean. Yeah? Just, just a little. We know how much he loves the summer. Right. And, and he seems a little bit down now that it's over. Uh, he joins us now from Greensboro, so let's check in. John, how are you holding up? Yeah, well, Jimmy and Lisa, I've been fighting with the fact that summer's over, but I think it's time for me just to accept it and embrace fall. And one good thing that comes along with fall is fall festivals, and there's one going on this weekend in Greensboro. It's the Greensboro Autumn Fest. I'm here with town manager Jeanette DeLue. Jeanette, thanks for joining me. Are you a fall lover? Absolutely. What's not to love? You got the fall colors, cooler air. It's a great time of year. And then to celebrate all the things that come along with fall this weekend here in Greensboro, you have uh, Autumn Fest. What's going to be going on? Well, Friday night, which is new this year, we're, we're expanding it to two days instead of one. So Friday night we have Mike Hines in the Look from 7 to 10. Um, cover charge only $5 to get in. And then we have uh, Autumn Fest all day on Saturday from 10 to 4. It's all kinds of face painting, pumpkin decorating, pumpkin chunking contests, yeah. Halloween costume contests, yeah. lots of family fun. Yeah, so those are the types of things that can, I guess, convert me into a fall lover. And so you, this starts on Friday night. Correct. And it goes through Saturday. Correct. Tell me the times and the dates. Friday from 7 to 10 and Saturday from 10 to 4. Okay, and then Friday, like you said, live music, Saturday, Halloween costumes, and there's also a pumpkin decorating, I guess, what is that, is that a competition or is that just, you know, come and decorate just your pumpkin? Just come and de decorate your pumpkin, uh -huh. get a free pumpkin, take it home with you. Well, I love, I do like to decorate pumpkins. Um, I guess that's one thing about fall that I really enjoy and we don't have enough time to do it live, so I, gra I grabbed one of my friends and we decorated two pumpkins last night, WBOC theme. Um, I didn't tell you which one I did, but I'm gonna see if you can judge and tell me what, which ones do you think? Wow, they're both great. I, I think this one definitely has the WBOC theme going on. You got the TV and the letters just like on the van, but that one's really creative and I like the colors and the, the festive look. So gonna, I, think, I think the WBOC festive you're gonna go with the I like it, all right. That's not the one I did, but uh, <laughs> I'll accept it. I do like the colors on this one. And if you want more information on the Greensboro Autumn Festival, you can visit our website, wboc.com, and click on our picture at the top of the page. Jimmy and Lisa, even though I'm a little upset that I didn't win the, the, the pumpkin contest that we had here, uh, I'm still proud of the one I did. I'll send it back to you guys. Well, I tell you what, Sean, for someone who is not a big fan of fall, he sure does know how to paint those pumpkins. Roll it right into the season, yeah, isn't he? Yeah, that look good. Well, there is nothing like a little music to get you in a festive mood. Music speaks to any kind of mood, really. And when it comes from multi-platinum winning artist Brian Adams, you know it'll be good. Up next on Del Marva Life, Brian joins us with a preview of his first studio album in six years. And a little later on, we're in the Del Marva Life kitchen making bacon cheddar empanadas. I love me some bacon, just want to share. <laughs> Del Marva Life, we'll be right back.